Hey guys, welcome back to another. Oops, sorry. Welcome back to another Fossad episode. How's everybody doing today? I'm doing just fine and dandy. Just uh, here at the Enderman Farm again. You guys might be like, dude, you were just here. Are you like always here or what? <sighs> no, no. You might be. You might be listening to. I don't have a helmet nor my boots, and that is what we enchanted last time was the helmet and the boots. And guess what happened? I got all my stuff enchanted and fixed, and yeah, yeah, yeah. I was like, oh, there's no reason for me to walk back up there. I have everything in the ender chest, and I can just do, 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 put everything back and checked. Okay, I have nothing. Okay, yep, I have nothing. Let's just go ahead and jump off the ledge. Woo! And then I press E, and I have my boots and my helmet on. My boots and my helmet. And I was like, what are you doing? You're just... Like, oh, I was just, like, what? Uh, uh, I just didn't understand why, how, how don't I, don't, uh, you know, whatever. I just didn't understand how I left my boots and my helmet on that I wanted to get so badly how I left those on. So, we are here today to put feather falling on a boot, um, feather falling on a pair of boots along with a unbreaking that I don't have nope nope and then I'm breaking that I don't have along with a um, aqua infinity and a respiration and a I'm breaking that I don't have yeah and then I'll put protection four probably on the boots or maybe I should do a protection five let's try protection five see what happens all right so let's put the protections together first here we go I'm going to take you guys through this with me besides killing the enderman if I have to kill some more endermen there we go. Let's put a protection five. Nope. Protection four is all we can get. Okay. I figured we could get a protection five, but I guess not. All right. So let's take out some of these. There we go. We need a pair of boots, like I said, and we need a helmet, like I said. There we go. Pair of boots and a helmet. So if we take those and we go right here, and hmm, what was I going? Pair of boots. I need an unbreaking, which I don't have an unbreaking, so let's... Nope. Feather falling. You like to fall on your head a lot, so you might want to do that there. So we need a break unbreaking on those. Yep. Aquafinity respiration. Yep. Yep, yep, yep. Aquafinity respiration. There we go. I'm already down levels. Okay. So I will go get these levels, and yeah. Okay, so I went ahead and got 24 levels, which will hopefully be enough to put both the Respiration and the Aqua Infinity on. And now I'm going to sit down here and get 30 more levels, just so I can have enough, hopefully, for both Unbreakings. And then I'm going to put them into the Ender Chest, and then I'm going to run back, just in case... I die somehow, so I will do that, and you guys can just you guys can just sit and listen to the great sounds. Oh my gosh! Uh, what happened? Oh man, man! <laughs> no way! Oh my gosh, I have no I have no way to get out of here. Well I do, but I just don't want to break the law, you know what I mean? Oh man. You guys might be thinking, what happened? Well I'm thinking kinda of the same thing. What happened? But uh I threw an ender pearl. I threw an ender pearl and I threw out I thought. I thought I threw it in a place where I was going up to get to the top. Oh my gosh, this is annoying. Let's see how many it's going to take just to do those. <sighs> okay. Unbreaking more yet. No, I'm not going to do that. Someone has been raiding my chest. Or maybe I did. Maybe last episode I did that. I don't know. That means I need another unbreaking. Because I need two unbreakings. Man. This sucks. This really sucks. We can always get the second unbreaking another time. But... <laughs> So I threw an ender pearl because usually when I get to the bottom of the stairs, because we have a staircase that climbs up to the area to get to the portal 
to jump back to the, uh, you know, to the top world or whatever you want to call it. Where's my, oh, what are you doing? I'm not paying attention because I'm so flustered about what just happened. Anyways, so I threw an ender pearl to get up to those stairs, get up the stairs faster, um, to get to the portal or whatever. And I ended up throwing it. I must have overthrew it by a little. Either someone redid up there. Someone must have redone up there because I swear there used to be walls all the way around the thing. I threw it right over the ledge of the top stair and it ended up somehow going over it, hitting the side of the end mountain or the end island and spawn. That's where it hit and I fell to my death. Oh, so I need 13 for that and 13 for that. So I needed 26 levels, which I have, but I don't have I don't have two unbreaking books. Now. Oh my gosh, dude, this is ridiculous. This is ridiculous. Well, uh. Man. Gosh dang it. Ugh. Well, I guess I'm gonna have to go back there and get some levels. Okay, so last time, this is what I did. I threw it. Oh my gosh, there's an airman up there. I didn't look at it, did I? No. So I just threw my ender pearl like right about there and it just barely went over that ledge. So let's see if someone like took out the back wall of the back walkway of this thing because <sighs> nope. I don't know what I hit. Maybe I missed threw it off to the side. I don't know. That's kind of annoying. It like maybe it like went right off there and hit right. I don't know. Either way. <sighs> Easy peasy. There we go. So now let's uh, get stuck back here again and throw that. There we go. Let's uh, take. We'll, we'll want the boots because the boots are going to do more damage. Um, let's go ahead and. Where'd that unbreak go? Oh, I was going to do the enchantment over there and then get more levels. Oh, that's all good. So let's get the uh, feather falling with the unbreaking. And there we go. Oh. Got my boots back, guys. Got my boots back. Let's put the helmet on. Just because we can. Just because we can. I know a lot of people take these respiration aqu aqua infinities. And they like, oh, this is going to be my underwater helmet. Yada, yada, yada. Well, that's not what I'm going to do. So, I don't like that. I don't like to kind of just section things off and whatnot. But, um, and say this is for this only and whatnot. But there's a, his casino. It's not a dirt mound anymore. Uh, I was on the other day and I was like, where did uh, Quake's? Uh, casino go and because he had it outlined in dirt and then it was totally torn down with nothing and I was like huh but he uh, redesigned it as a circle now instead of the big honking square he used to have which I think circles are always better than squares um, so yeah but we're gonna I'm gonna do a little maintenance around here and stuff and uh, we're gonna actually head over to where we're gonna b actually b actually build on this server as a base um, this will still be a continuing project, but I just want to kind of get somewhere else. So we will bring you guys back. All right, guys. Well, we're back and it's raining, but if, for those of you that don't remember, this is where I'm building. Ah, oh, we got the nice little extreme hills biome right here. Um, and this is why I liked it. It was extreme hills and I love extreme hills overhangs and everything like that. There's an overhang right below us. There's that one right over there. And then we're right by a jungle biome and a desert biome. Now, I haven't really explored the desert biome that much. I'm pretty sure someone's probably been over here by now. Um, maybe, maybe not. I don't know. But, uh, you know, once we once the new biomes and everything come out, uh, I know people have been over that way, but we could go, you know, three, 4,000 blocks over that way uh, to get to the new biomes. Um, and also, when I eventually go finding a horse, I'm going to go that way. So what I'm gonna do here is I don't want to like just obviously build on this, uh, you know I don't want to just build on this, <laughs> this uh, landform right here. I need to definitely make it a little bit easier for building. Um, I don't know exactly how low I want to go. Is that a creeper? That's a creeper. What's up, creeper? There you go. Right. Um, I don't know how low exactly I want to go, um, but I'm thinking for sure take off at least the top like five layers I even thought about maybe taking off everything above this layer and that's what I'm gonna start with is just start from this layer layer laver talk start from this level and uh, just kind of 
go. It shouldn't take too long with the tools I have. I'm using my silk touch pick. I figured uh, this one is better to be using my fortune because my fortune, I don't have another one of where I have a silk touch if anything will be. Uh, and just to have the grass. It's always nice having grass block. So I'm just going to keep doing this and uh, maybe do a little bit of this too here once in a while just to get the stone out. Um, and yeah, then you guys will see Here's the before, and I'll bring you back with the after. So here it is with no dirt. We still have to get rid of all this stone, but it's a nice platform up here to build on. And uh, so that's the dirt gone with just the stone left. And then we will bring you back when we get all the stone gone. So guys, there is the finished landscape for now. Um, and the reason why I say for now is I haven't fully decided what I want to do with this right over here yet. Um, if I want to uh, leave it or if I want to do something with it or, you know, my thoughts and plans right now are to uh, to uh, kind of build into it and make it maybe like the storage area or something. I don't fully know yet. Um, but yeah, I don't know. But anyways... Right now, that might have to be terraformed too. I might have to cut it off at like that level right there. So, and I might even just have to fully take it out. I really liked it. Like that was one of the things that attracted me to this spot. But I might just have to take it out for my build. Um, so the way my I haven't decided. See, the reason why I'm undecided if this is gonna stay or not is because it really depends on which way I want my house or my base to face. Um, part of me says have it go off this ledge. But the only thing I don't like about that, welcome back. The only thing I don't like about that fact, let's go shooting for some, for some things. Um, the only thing I don't like about that is that I wanted it to kind of be like a cliff where I'm going to build. I want it to kind of be over the cliff. It's going to kind of be like, a, I don't know what to say, like a little bit of an Iron Man thing where it's like, not the Iron Man house, but that sort of like build where it kind of overhangs on the uh, the Tony Stark build where it overhangs over like a little mountain cliff thing and let's kill you um, so I don't I mean so I don't really know what I want it to where I want to build yet if I build over here then I have like this oh get away um, then you have like this hill cliff thing which I mean I could terraform it to be like i build it right here and then i just take this down down one or two levels on every level so that it like is more of a drop off than what it currently is i mean i could always do that but i don't know and the reason why i would do that would just be if people come ah <laughs> oh good thing i heard that um would be as if if people come on boat Spawn is around that bend and over there, a thousand blocks or so, eight hundred thousand blocks. So you come around, and if you're coming from spawn by boat, you'd come around and you'd see it right here. So part of me wants to build it right here, but then the other part of me like wants to build it right here, just right here, just facing out. And and part of that reason is just the landscape, like over there oh yeah ocean's beautiful you can see the sunset and sunrise and or not the sunrise but you can see the sun set rise in the east sets in the west uh whatever whichever one it is um you'd be able to whoa you'd be able to see that but i don't know i just have i just don't know where i want to build it I'm not gonna face it that way i don't want to face it that way that's for sure the only contemplating is if it's this way if it's gonna be this way, just because this is like the biggest like actual cliff. This is this is too though. You know, let's go down. Let's go down and see. Maybe that will help me decide. Clear game. Doo -doo -doo. Um, let's see. Maybe this will help me decide. You know, if my house seen like I said, I might just get rid of that. If the house is right there, would that be cool? Like if you came over to this and you just saw a massive building right there. See, but that might not even be big enough. Uh, let's go out to that, that island over there. 
which I think we could end our pull up there if we get if we go over there. I'm pretty sure we could. Nice. Nice. There we go. Nope. Yep. Got it. Nailed it. Okay. Perfect. Let's see if we can make it out to that island from here. That's gonna be the question. Do 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 do. do. It's gonna be one heck of a. Th <laughs> if I get this, that's gonna be one heck of a throw. Mm. Oh, pretty good. That was pretty good. See, but then if we terraform it and, man, I don't know. This is a tough decision. Tough, tough, tough. Because then if we terraform and take that out and then we build it just on top of that cliff right there and kind of facing this way mm. I don't know that's a tough decision tough decision I don't know what do you guys think I really don't know because this this is a really nice like cliff to build off of but it's I don't know 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 Maybe I could like build down here and then like have part of my building go up there. That's what I'll probably do. Yeah, yeah, that's what we'll do. Or should we build? Yeah, we'll build this way. You know, that's what we're gonna do. Well, if we need to shave off this cliff a little bit, I'll do that, I don't care. Um, it won't take long. But, so what we'll do is we'll build the face of it off of here, like right along here, and then uh, the building back there and stuff and then assuming there's enough room and then uh maybe we can just build a portion of the house up there so i will uh i brought some stuff over let's see if we can get this ender chest i brought some stuff over just like money nailed it nope missed it <laughs> nailed it no you didn't no you didn't dude oh nope Definitely didn't nail that. Yep. Nope, definitely didn't nail it. Dang it. I, I did this twice already. Come on. Yeah, 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 There we go. Oh, I bought ran off, bought ran off. All right. So we got some. We got quartz, which is one going to be one of the main blocks. And, uh, well, quartz is going to be the main block. Man, this is going to be a huge quartz build. Um, so I'll definitely have to go to the nether and get some of that. But, uh. You know, I don't have an ender eye, so I... Uh, shoot. Shoot. Um, maybe I'll go back to spawn and get an ender eye. That's all quartz. Oh, no, that's iron. Um, maybe I'll go back to spawn and get an ender eye. So that I can rebuild this. Because that's what I'm doing right now, is I'm going to break it. And I'm going to get all that. And then I'm going to bust this and drop... Nice. Good thing I got them feather falling boots. So I will go back to spawn and uh, remake the remake some stuff and bring some more stuff over here. All right. So that's what I got right now. Um, I ran out of quartz, as you guys can see. Um, I decided to build it right there because the build that I'm kind of referring to, not really necessarily going off of, but just what I'm referring to, um, that right there is the top layer that 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 piece right there that overlooks that i was wanting to build over there over on the other side is kind of the top layer of the build of the build and it's like a three layer build um three level house type thing so since it's like that i decided well i should just uh um build that on top then and then kind of build the next layer on that flat layer and then build uh another layer somewhere else so uh Kaniva wants me to come over to his base so this is what i got for the build today uh we're gonna finish the episode over at Kaniva base Kaniva's base it looks like uh show you guys what he's got going on i really like the build he's got going um looks really good almost as good as mine but you know what can you say gosh come on get up get up get up yeah all right so i'll see you guys over there so guys, this is what Kaniva's got going on. It looks pretty bad, bad to the bone. You know what I'm saying? I really like it. You guys can check out his channel. I'll try to remember to put it in the description. Oh, 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 he's trying to kill me. He's trying to kill me. Great, it looks great. Uh, this is a great view of it, and so is over there. Um, 
but it's just it's like it's like monumental it's really cool he was uh talking about uh at one point making it kind of like beefs where he wanted to build an underwater but then he came up with this idea and then it just looks so nice i love it i mean i think it's great it's got a lot of depth everywhere and it's got nice structure it the colors go good together the green the quartz and uh, a little bit of quartz in there but the stone and there's even cobble which you know i'm not a big fan of cobble uh but you know i'm really starting to like those cobble uh pillar things that they have right there and i like their use of it with the fences to add that depth layer where you get the regular stone size then you get the depth of this cobblestone fence thing pillar and then you get the fence depth where it's like three different layers of depth and i really like it and then he also put depth in there it looks good i like i like it a lot so let's see what should we do to Kniva? should we should we hit him off oh 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 <laughs> what's he got going down going on down here Ooh, it's a secret stash Secret stash of nada. Nada. I don't know what he's doing. But anyways, guys. Ah! <laughs> anyways, guys. You yeah, know, like always, my name's V... Ooh. What's he gonna do? What's he gonna do? What's he gonna do? Is he throwing something? Like always, guys. <laughs> my name's Real Asai. Dre oh, let's get his name in there. Let's get his name. Why am I so far away? Is he shifting? Wait, oh no, because I have that on. Right, like always, guys, my name is VLSI. Let's take a screenshot of this. F, nope, nope, F, F, nope. Hey, stand right there. There you go. Dream big. Bye.